So today, we're going to take, we got to weld some brackets on the bottom of this radiator to hold the weight, the radiator up, the brackets inside, I'll show you when we get it all done. The rod and the weight completely, so we're going to take this counterweight off, which is going to be a trick. Get the counterweight off, pull the parts right in and weld on that, put it together. So now we're trying to figure out the connections of everything off. We're also trying to figure out how we hang this counterweight. So which becomes our tricky point, we don't know. So Miguel's working on this. Jose's watching very efficiently, but he's doing a good job. So <laughs> he's like, shut up. I'm going to tell you the action. I'll tell you later. Yeah, that comes up. Um, so there's the push down right there. There it is. I got it. Okay, I got it now. I think I broke it. No? Okay. All right. Now, still, how are we going to lift it? Yeah, we got to take the light down. What do you want me to say? I'm stuck here, man. <laughs> Dang it. Anyway, they're trying to get the nuts off the inside. We're going to use the extension on the back side to twist them. I don't think you can hear me anyway. It's really loud on this work, man. But we're going to try to hear what I'm saying. Make the nuts and the bolts off the counter. <coughs> Okay, I'm turning the forklift off. Turn the forklift off, but to be honest with you, I'm not sure we're going to get started again. <laughs> Are you making Jose squash? Have we ever had Jose squash before? We can make Jose squash. Jose fuego. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay. Now, you want me to you want me to go yeah. forward? Now that we got it here, let's cut holes in this counterweight. <laughs> Freaking counterweight. That's crazy. Okay. Oh, Alright, now comes the engineering part. The way I see it is if I put a if I put a pipe under here, like that, it's good. Okay, so here's the deal. These tabs. That we're looking at this is where the radiator sits now the radiator sits on rubber bushings that sit on here so there's no bolts it just sits down on it and this one is completely eaten away and this was this one is like that's about halfway but it's about to, it's about to give up the ghost so we're going to clean these up so that i can weld and put a chunk of this pipe underneath it to hold them up solid so then they're leaning on this 
that's kind of the operation. So it's it's not as intense as I first thought it was going to be because we thought that was cast. It's actually mild steel, so I'll be able to weld to it better. Again, I'm not the world's best welder, but hey, for being a farmer and, and, farmer and welding for a farmer, I'm good. It'll work. <laughs> Well, that's sure a lot better than what I thought it was going to be. Actually, a lot better than that counter we got. I'm not sure it's going to be stiff on my head doing this. The worst part about it is when you point the thing out that needs to be fixed, and then you go, dang it, if I hadn't pointed that out, maybe I wouldn't have had to be standing on my head to weld this thing. But no, you got it fixed. Always point things out. They got to be fixed, they got to be fixed. several ways to measure. One would be to mark it, and the other would be to turn the saw on and scratch it. And I do the lazy man's way. You can't actually change it, you can move them to the top. Right? Okay. You think you're gonna get the fire? I'm not, I'm not yeah. sure if you're gonna pick up. Yeah. You know that other one you got actually? Oh, so this is the on off. Okay, so that on, on off is in there, that's the high low right there. Okay. So what I think is just let it run the choke as long as you will, but then it'll shut down. Come on! Don't All right, do you want to try and put the uh, counter right back on? Uh, I'll let them worry about it. Come okay. On All right. Hey, thanks for watching. You're good. You can turn it off after that. <laughs> He's like, I can't move. I'm frozen in place. <laughs> well, I'm waiting for you to say GoPro turn off. GoPro turn off. Okay. This is honestly the last time I'm going to tell you this. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> we uh, got it all put back together. 
So basically, it's all put, put back, back together, but we got a we got an oil leak. So we're having to pull half of it back apart again. Well, not half of it, but a good portion of it. Oh man, my beard's everywhere. And we're gonna have to check, and we're gonna tighten that last hose up where the oil is. But other than that, it runs, everything's back together. You know what, honestly, these guys did most of the work and they did a really good job. So uh, thanks for watching.